If you are looking for the best winter cycling gloves, you are in the right place. We have tried to include in-depth information on winter cycling gloves in our video, which will be enough to fulfill all of your needs. All of them are maintaining their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturer, and real customer feedback. If you want to buy a winter cycling gloves, we think this list will be very worthy to you. Now, let's get started with the video. The first position of our list, we have Santini 365 Origin Long Finger GLO VS. The Italian-made cycling glove aren't quite at the deep winter level, but even with the sufferer of cold hands tester, we found them good to around zero on the thermometer. The classy-looking Italian-made Santini 365 Origin Long Finger gloves get the balance exactly right between low bulk, warmth, lightweight, and good dexterity, although we did miss the touchscreen capability. The tall cuff was great at preventing cold glove to jersey gaps ideal for any long-armed riders who often suffer from this when at full stretch. We've also found them to be one of the best winter cycling glove pair at keeping out the wet stuff thanks to the lack of synthetic suede, which on test we found can be the weak patch in gloves, although it's worth remembering that windstopper fabric does eventually wet out in heavy rain. The Windstopper X Free 300 fabric is impressively stretchy and performs well in keeping out the wind. The design team at Santini have been clever at reversing the fabric on the thumb in order to create a thumb wipe, something that the more expensive Rafa Pro Team Winter Gloves and Asosa Sasuar's Winter Gloves don't even have. But while it is handy when the eventual nose drip occurs on a cold ride, it is a the slight sacrifice of thumb warmth. A good price for a pair of great winter cycling gloves that will get you through all but the coldest days on the bike. Moving on to the next at number 2 with Altora Fire ES Torm Reflect IVE GLOVS. Soft Jomaine Body Fabric and an Amara Suede Palm. The Firestorm gloves provide plenty of protection from the elements. They're not quite as robust at keeping out the elements as the Castelli Perfetto Row S gloves, and they're not a total barrier and downpour. But they will keep the worst off and ditto for wind chill, and the Altora Dry Technology Fabric is true to its word in being quick wicking. On test, these gloves have kept hands warm and mostly dry throughout the harsh winter months, especially when teamed with a glove liner to help extend the temperature range and they've remained in good condition proving their durability. We found the Amara Suede was a great choice for a low bulk palm, allowing for great secure radial grip on the bars. It did, however, get a little sweaty once up to full gas riding temperature. The finger touch screen compatibility worked well for unlocking a smartphone or basic cycle computer functionality. However, anything that requires more detailed finger dexterity, such as typing, wasn't really a goer with smaller hands. Due to the oversized unisex cut of these cycling gloves, it's a minor point as otherwise, these are a great choice bike glove, especially for city night riders as their amazing reflective nature does make these a standout pair in traffic, especially when signaling at junctions. The Altora Firestorm reflective gloves are a great winter cycling gloves for the money. But just watch the sizing on this unisex pair. The number three position is held by Castelli Perfect TO ROS GLOVS. On test, we absolutely love these, finding them so close to being the best winter cycling gloves that we gave them a covered cycling weekly editor's choice award. Using the latest Gore Infinium Windstopper fabric, the Castelli Perfetto Row S gloves manage the difficult balance between adequate insulation, water repellents, and windproofing on the one hand, and bar feel and ride comfort on the other. It's something that the Altora Firestorm Reflective Gloves and Santini 365 Origin Long Finger Gloves also do well, but when on in writing, it's clear that these are the elite winter cycling gloves. With a light fleece lining, there's enough warmth to keep the hands warm and even after hours of light rain, they stay dry. Once the water does make it in, your hands stay warm, and there's enough dexterity to work the controls and keep yourself fed as you ride. Next at number 4, we have LUSO Wintex Thermo Stealth GLOVS. Lusso's gloves look, feel and perform in a way that's very much on par with some of the best winter cycling gloves at twice the price. On these we found these warm, breathable and comfortable to wear. The primary material is a Wintex membrane thermal fabric, which extends from the high cuff all the way to the fingers on the outside. It's stretchy and the high elasticity means this fit close to the skin without needing to be so tight they are hard to remove. The windproof gloves are water repellent and come with a snugly fleecy liner for great warmth. The padding might be a little excessive for some, but then riders who struggle with numb hands via cold or pressure on the handlebar will take this as a plus. 
Without this, the design would feel very similar to the higher end and double the price Castelli Perfetto Row S gloves. An impressive pair of winter cycling gloves for the money. The number 5 position is held by Defeat Diraglo VSET. There can't be many cyclists that don't own a piece of Defeat kit. The brand seem to have a winning concept, where they nail a design and simply repeat. The classic lightweight Defeat Dura gloves are perfect for fall slash autumn and early spring and have been a mainstay for the brand since forever. This version, however, gains a technical upgrade with the e-touch mean using your touchscreen device no longer require glove removal. They aren't the most slimline pair, but are far from bulky, and it has been known to ride of them under a pair of really deep winter gloves, but such as the Gyro 100 proof winter gloves for total winter protection, and allowing you to keep a layer on when removing to use a touchscreen. The thing we love most about these, however, is the fact that they are the best winter cycling gloves for adding a pop of color to your ride, with five distinctive options to choose from. The number six position is dominated by Seal Eskins Waterproof Cold Weather GLO VS with Fusion Control. Seal Skins describes its trademarked fusion control technology as revolutionary. It consists of three layers, a merino wool inner layer, a hydrophilic waterproof membrane, and a durable goat skin with soft shell outer layer. On test, these provided very good protection on a cold, wet days in the saddle, with very little, if any, water ingress. We also noticed the great windproofing capabilities on these secure-fitting gloves. We found these great at keeping hand warm at milder winter temperatures of between 39-50 degrees Fahrenheit slash 4 and 10 degrees Celsius. The goatskin palms not only helped with keeping the elements at bay, they perform excellently in terms of control of the handlebars or operating the brakes, a real plus point for anyone who struggles when hand motor control in the cold or the slippery sensation in the rain. The triple layers are, however, quite bulky. So if you're a rider who enjoys frequent gear changing, filling with minor bike adjustments on the move, you may find them too bulky. The only other consideration is the fact that you can't just shove them in the washing machine. In theory, the natural fabric shouldn't build up the odors that synthetic ones do, but probably not the pair for an off-road muddy adventure. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Grip Grab Ride Waterproof Winter GLO VS. The gloves from Danish company Grip Grab are well-suited to UK conditions. The Ride Waterproof Winter gloves feature a breathable membrane and retain heat when it's cold. Balancing out the requirement for thermal insulation while maintaining dexterity can be hard to master for glove, but we found these manage the task admirably maintaining their warmth on even wet days, thanks to effective waterproofing. Grip Grab's own Dr. Gel pad is featured at the heel of the palm, which we found on test is in just the right place when riding on the hoods. The palm, forefinger, and middle fingertips use silicone for grip, and there's a touchscreen tip on the thumb, as well as a terry back. There's a reflective dot pattern on the bottom half of the back. The lawn cuff extends some way over the wrist, and uses a Velcro tab to close, much like the Specialized Prime Series Thermal Gloves, Although this time it's not quite a slimline, so we'll have to fasten up over your winter jacket sleeve. The area where the Grip Grab Ride Waterproof Winter Gloves excel, however, despite their name, is the volume of reflective detailing. Making these the best winter cycling gloves to wear on night ride in all weather, with standout hand signaling that other road users can't help but see. The only thing to note is that we found these come up small so you might need to size up. The number 8 position is held by Rafa PRO Team Winter GLO VS. The Rafa Pro Team Winter Gloves standout feature is their lack of bulk. On test, we were really impressed at how this low-profile package was capable of keeping hands warm, performing exceptionally well at really low temperatures. We loved the minimal padding on these and found them the perfect winter cycling glove for its excellent grip in all weather. With zero dexterity compromises, including both navigating a touchscreen and unwrapping a mid-ride energy bar, they are certainly a performance pair, and we found them to be the best winter cycling glove to pull on for winter league racing. The windproof back of the gloves does a really good at blocking the cold, but it's worth noting that these are water-resistant, not proof, so in the rain, the backs of the gloves does keep out the water thanks to a DWR coating, which will need reapplying at some point that makes raindrops beat off. But we did find that the synthetic suede palms absorb it. There's no denying the high price tag that the Rafa Pro Team Winter Gloves command, more than both the other elite brand's winter offerings, such as the Asosa Sassoir's Winter Gloves or Castelli Perfetto Row S Gloves. However, if you want the perfect winter cycling glove for racing, then these are spot on. Next at number 9, we have his SOS's S Osori S Winter GLO VS. The Asosa Sassoir's winter gloves have all the quality and style you'd expect at this price and from this brand. 
On test, we found the wind blocking properties on this pair was excellent, and they really impressed in their warmth for such a low bulk glove. They are great all rounders thanks to the great dexterity, meaning there wasn't a lot that isn't possible when wearing them, including zipping up jackets and locking the front door. The sweet spot weather wise for these great winter cycling gloves is probably around the 44 dig F slash 7 dig C in the dry mark, as they aren't the best on the rainiest of days, with the microfiber palm breaching water very quickly. Like most gloves these days, there's an adjustable Velcro wrist closure, and while not quite as long as the Santini 365 Origin Long Finger Gloves, it's still plenty long enough to sit under your winter jacket or jersey sleeve without gaps appearing. The only real Marmite issue is the palm foam, and Joe paddling arrangement might not be to everyone's taste. If you're the kind of rider who like the sound of the minimalist Rafa Pro Team Winter Gloves, these really aren't for you. However, for anyone tackling a winter row bakes, these could be just what you want. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Specialized Prime SERES Thermal GLOVS. We really rated these winter cycling gloves for a more of a mild winter option, ideal for the late autumn and early spring riding in changeable conditions. The Polartec Neoshell backs are as totally waterproof as Polartec claims. The AX suede palms are hydrophobic. They're not waterproof, so badged as water resistant. On test, we found they can happily withstand a light shower or drizzle no problem. But as we've said with the likes of the Asos, Asoswar's Winter Gloves, and the Rafa Pro Team Winter Gloves, this style of microfiber it will always get wet, so it's a matter of when not if. On test, we found the cuff really well done, with its Velcro adjustable closure a break from the current trend of just stretchy. It allows you to fine-tune the fit without adding additional bulk, allowing the cuff to be over or under your jacket slash jersey sleeve. Their lightweight nature affords great breathability, especially on the days when it's a colder start and then warms up, or vice versa. Although if your hands do get hot, the Specialized Prime Series Thermal Gloves are light and packable enough to stash in a pocket. The only real downside is their lower temperature range limitation, meaning that it's likely that you'll have to invest in something like the Rafa Pro Team Winter Gloves, or even the Rafa Deep Winter Gloves for real freezing rides. That's all for today. All the product links in the description down below. We upload videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button for the upcoming video notification.